Guys, we're off to a pretty bad start to Monterey Car Week 2018. I was hoping to get this towed and into the dealership by the end of today and have that sorted out because Hamid was going to hook it up. Unfortunately, this is the second tow truck, AAA tow truck, that has come here and is unable to sort this out. A lot of issues with this car. First things first, we had to use the emergency key, which is the worst design known to mankind. You have to stick the emergency key down there and rotate it to your left, and it'll open up. But we can't put the car in neutral right now because the car won't start. Thus, we cannot get the car towed on out of here back to the dealership service center. So the first tow truck came. He tried to jump start the car through here so we could get this car on out of here and put it in neutral, but that was to no avail. Trying to jump start it for like the 10th billionth time. They jump started it from here through the engine. That's not working, so we're doing it from the trunk right over here where the battery is located. Uh, he tried a portable charger, didn't work. Now he's connected directly to his truck to right over here. The positive and negative is ready to roll and of course nothing is happening. So we're going to let this thing charge up a little bit. He thinks the alternator or the starter is uh, pretty fucked up as well. But the battery is absolutely dead. And of course we got a couple of Mr. Sheep just chilling right over here. Stay tuned for Monterey Car Week. We got some big surprises happening very soon. I'm actually filming this with my phone. So uh, this car is most likely not making it to Monterey. But don't worry guys, I got a couple of special surprises for you. We're taking delivery of two brand new cars. So uh, goodbye Jag. Hello, two new cars. I'm gonna show them very shortly after we deal with this nonsense. Hopefully we can get this thing towed out of here and to the dealership. But uh, yeah, we're having a lot of issues. Here we go guys, we got a brand new set of Michelin Pilot PS4s ready to rock and roll for the SVR. But I have Pirelli's on right now that I need to burn off or I was going to burn them off doing some donuts and uh, drifts for you guys. But uh, as you know, the car is it's not really working out. So uh, anyways, here we go guys, taking delivery of two new cars. We got the two press cars, the Levante. Our buddy Adam has rented out a Lexus SUV GX. Of course, we got Marcus's 911 right over here. Of course, we got Chris Morrison's Golf R and the LS500 F Sport. Here with the Pagani Raduno at an unknown destination. We got the BC all the way from Florida. We got Prestige, Brett Davids. Of course, this one's from the Bay Area. All red carbon fiber Roadster. Zona F from Paraguay. BC, the Keen, and one more up there. And of course, we got a Zero Dino's Bizarre Wrapped Spiker. Vanquish, and I don't know why that's on there. It's a strange choice. And of course, you got the 918 hiding over there. What else we got here? Uh, TDF and a couple auxiliary cars, but man, this is actually pretty nice. Check that out. Ooh, red carbon is glistening in the sunlight here. I uh, kind of messed up because I forgot my polarizer. I kind of misplaced it. This is a car we've seen in Beverly Hills driving on Rodeo. And of course, it's got the funky little shark fin in the back. Of course, the usual suspects got the keen as well. So, anyways, we're just uh, stopping by. We're going to be en route to. Monterey and Carmel very soon, so uh, stay tuned, I guess. Here we go, we got a Zero Dino's Bizarrely Wrapped C8 Spiker convertible right over here. Even more bizarre car on the Reduno is the brand new Fisker Rivero, is that what it's called? The Rivero, like what in the good lord's name is this doing here? I thought this brand was dead. Give me some love. No love. And over here, is where they hang people. Just kidding. Got the lonely TDF here, and the one car that we all care about, the Zonda F, is at the gas station, so, uh, sorry guys. Hey! Back at it, we got the whole squad here. As you saw earlier, we introduced the brand new Lexus LS500 F Sport. We got Chris Morrison's Golf R, Marcus's 911 Porsche. Of course, we got Adam's GX Lexus, which is like a fucking boat. Of course, we got the one and only Levante right over here that we reviewed earlier in the vlog. So anyways, all the cars are gassing up. We got the Zonda F right over there. And uh, now we're rolling. Excuse me, sir, your front lift is off. 
Much better than the Porsche 918. Mm. Uh, why is he? So I'm not really sure what's going on. I highly doubt he got me on radar, but he said I was speeding at an undisclosed speed, but he was in front of me. So he probably has like a rear detecting radar, but uh, yep. RIP. custom place that they have for like the Koenigsegg, the Trocken has one, RS1 has one, and so does your mother. Don't even know what to say, we're currently in the LS500 F Sport, listening to Ariana's new album, Will He Do a Pool for Us? Uh, something has happened here, oh, oh. Uh. <laughs> What the fuck? You idiot. <laughs> I have no idea where we are, but we just saw a man drive through a fucking fence. And now there's a Kodak's egg in the dirt. <sighs> there she is, guys. The LS500 F Sport. We're going to be taking this to Car Week. We also got the Maserati Levante taking delivery of two new cars while the SVR remains completely broken and left and abandoned at my apartment. So uh, let's check out the Koenigsegg RS1 over there, guys. We've reached higher ground and in the distance is a lonely Koenigsegg Agera RS1. Here it comes. Here it comes. Are we stopping here? That's actually pretty sick. Hmm. Hello, hello. Probably a snake hole right there. Yep. Oh look, I found a big snake. Hello, Alex. Fuck you. <laughs> the Garrett RS1 key. Get the shot. Getting the shot. A closer shot. Or an even closer shot. Uh oh. We got like a park ranger or conundrum going on here. Some guy in a pickup truck might want to be uh, going up there, so, hmm. There he goes. Cap the Ranger, boy. Mm. Yeah, I'm not what? sure how I'm not being clear. Park Rangers, you're here illegally. He's turning around. You're in violation. We've asked nicely. And now I'm going to start wrecking tickets. Feel free to record that. Oh, no, I'm just, but, I'm just recording, but yeah. But it is time to go. All right, There's a misunderstanding, yeah. Thank you very much. Hmm. Not a very nice uh, park ranger. Okay. I don't know. He just said we could take some. One more shot. He, yeah, he said we could U-turn the cars around, going that way, and we get a few more shots. And now he's threatening to write us fucking tickets. And this guy's being a complete dick about it. Why is he blocking the RS1? I don't know. Hmm. Talk about passive aggressive, dude. It's no need. What a dick. All right, let's go. That was quite bizarre because the park ranger said we could get a few more shots, pivoted, and said we couldn't and threatened to write us a ticket, but... Just arrived in Monterey and uh, we're greeted by a red Ford GT. And there's a Chiron to my left. That's a, that's a pretty good plate. One 1967. Hmm, nice. Got another spot, LRB. That's some Arab shit. First, middle, and last initial. No US bumpers, but he messed up. Got the chrome wheels. Real question is, is it real? I don't know, I have my doubts. I got my doubts, guys. It's an electric cop bike, no way. Boy, look at that. Monterey 
ahead of the curve. I like that. Dude, Monterey Car Week vibes. They got the whole light show and everything. Spotlights. I think they're testing out the lights right now because there's no real party happening, but 